The expectations of space researchers are always on point. If you ask why, well, we have the reasons that can satisfy you. It was predicted that a weird rocket will strike the moon's surface, and guess what? This very thing took place for real. Tensions have emerged in the arena of space owing to the occurrence of this strange event because the debris of the rocket that crashed on the moon had its origins in a mysterious rocket launched by China. Yes, you heard it right. It is China lying at the very root of the problems that are soon rearing their heads in the space world. Is China going to wage a political war by pulling outer space into the domain of international politics? Well, you'll get all your answers here. Before we begin, don't forget to press the like and subscribe button, so you know never miss anything about the James Webb Telescope updates, NASA news, and other interesting space updates. With that being said, welcome to Space News Unfold. Let's get into unraveling this thrilling news. As you can already guess, no nation has its habitual feature to accept the mishaps it creates. And China is no exception. After the remnant of a Chinese rocket crashed on moon's surface, the power-hungry nation has buried itself with coming up with excuses to cover up its fault in this rocket-moon collision. Is China now trying to invade the moon? Maybe. Or maybe not. Anyway, this is quite a grave situation. The mysterious collision not only led to the destruction of the rocket, but also probably going to lead to the formation of a deep crater on the moon. And guess what? This crater can be as wide as 65 feet. Now, isn't that insane? Initially, it was a moment of triumph and relief for China because the astronomical trackers had thought that the crashed item was probably a remnant of Elon Musk's SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket that had got on a mission to launch a weather satellite in 2015. But obviously, that was not so. After carrying out a great deal of investigation, astronomers came up with the shocking discovery that it was the debris of the long Mark 3C rocket which is part of the Chinese mission of Chang'u's 5T1. Wondering what this Chinese mission was all about? Well, through this mission, the ever-ambitious nation of China sent a rocket to revolve around the moon to test whether this spacecraft could be brought back to Earth. Once it completed its mission of reaching the moon, do you know what the climactic point is? Well, much to the disappointment of China, a huge chunk of the Chinese rocket got stuck to a long elliptical orbit around the Earth and ultimately found itself crashing to the side of the moon. But is this really the chief intention of China as long as sending this rocket to the moon is concerned? If yes, why didn't China immediately accept that the rocket belonged to it? This may shock you, but China really tried hard to deny that the rocket didn't belong to its space program. In fact, it came up with blatant lies and excuses to cover up for its blunder. Isn't it pretty unbelievable? What we're going to share with you next may surprise you, but guess what? China came up with the great excuses to cover up for the accident on the moon. The nation proclaimed that this rocket crash on the surface of the moon would cast no harmful impact on the environment of the moon and also won't create hurdles when things come to the feasibility of launching other lunar missions. Interestingly, Yang Yu Guang, who is the Chinese official of the Space Transportation Committee under the International Aeronautical Federation, came up with the theory of passivation to brush off the blame from China's shoulders. Now, you might be wondering what passivation is. Well, it basically refers to the process by which the leftover remains of a crashed rocket are eliminated from orbit. By the very companies that sent the rocket to space to prevent any further explosions triggered by the presence of the rocket debris. Of course, it is done to safeguard the existence of other active satellites in space. But, does China really care about the longevity of other satellites that are currently functioning in space? The rocket crashed at Hertzsprung Crater, which is located on the farthest side of the moon. China has already been criticized several times recently for its irresponsible actions in space. Yet, its trait of making excuses to cover up its faults seems to be endless. Things just keep turning murkier in space with China being an active player in the initiation of these reckless practices. What's coming next is sure to surprise you. China really knows how to play a trick, because, well, its acknowledgement about crashing of the rocket on the moon did not arrive so early. Instead of confessing that the rocket was part of the country's space program, China made up lies, saying the rocket came back to Earth and then crashed into the atmosphere. A great twist comes with what Wang Wienbin, who is the spokesperson for China's Ministry of Foreign Affairs, had to say in this matter. He said what we just mentioned a lie a while ago, that is, 
The upper portion of the long Mark 3C rocket had fallen through the atmosphere of our dear Earth in an apparently safe way, and then got burnt entirely. Situations are turning graver as the power-hungry leaders in China may have disastrous plans in the back of their minds. Is it trying to thwart other nations and emerge as a superpower in the world by establishing its dominance on the moon? Well, of course, China won't admit it now. But what if it sparks conflict with other nations in the world? After all, don't we know how strong its desires are when things come to its greed of emerging as a superpower in this increasingly unipolar world? It is crucial to stay cautious at this moment because, of course, we can't let ourselves get embroiled in a political war when the world is literally stranded in the grave circumstances of a seemingly third world war. Mists of doubt still linger on like Space Force's 18th Space Control Squadron, or 18 SPCS, which is responsible for tracking the presence of debris and spacecraft left over surrounding Earth, got confused while coming up with its findings. Though initially it agreed with the excuse that China made, it later confirmed that the Chinese Long Mark 3C rocket had never entered the atmosphere. In fact, it was present in space since the time of its launch. A big riddle that has reared its head in the space world is that the US Space Command is now expressing uncertainty over the country of origin of the rocket. No one seems to be too sure about certain things, and that's what makes things a tad bit puzzling. Space researchers think that a crash on the moon is not likely going to inflict any harm on the lunar environment because space agencies and various other nations have already crashed several objects on the lunar surface multiple times in the past. But all these things are mere conjectures. No one knows for sure if the emergence of adverse effects in the space world would be real. However, the only respite is that this crash by the Chinese rocket occurred on the unexplored farthest side of the moon. So, that probably eases the tensions that had emerged from the space officials. However, the danger may stem from a different possibility altogether. We all know how China, under its president Xi Jinping, has evolved to become a global superpower. It already has an extremely modernized military force, great economic condition, and of course, a wide array of overly ambitious space programs and lofty missions. By attacking the moon and establishing its domination over it, China may exhibit its prowess to the world, and who knows, it may even use violence to replace the US and move ahead to become the sole superpower in the world. If that happens, dire consequences may be awaiting us. Anyway, the dispute related to this mysterious Chinese rocket crash on the lunar surface still remains unresolved, and of course, the space researchers need to watch out for the arrival of any other debris towards both our planet and the moon. How thrilled are you to know that this dreadful event of the Chinese rocket crash on the moon? Are we going to witness yet another violent incident triggered by China? Let us know your views in the comments section below. Also, don't forget to press the like button and tap the subscribe button so you never miss any news about the James Webb Telescope, NASA News, and other exciting space updates. See you soon in our next video.